Hi guys, this is Kevin for Pixavert.com. In this video, we're going to be creating a high pass sharpening filter inside of the GIMP. We've got an image here, which has got some interesting kind of mechanical detail. It's got some out of focus elements, a little bit of noise. And I want to go ahead and just sharpen it a little bit using high pass sharpening. We're going to duplicate the image change the name of the layer to GE for grain extract, duplicate that and change the top layer to GM for grain merge. We're going to change the middle layer to grain extract blending mode and the top one to grain merge. We'll go to the middle layer, go to filter blur GB Gaussian blur and we're going to apply a small amount of sharpening using the Gaussian blur filter. So the blur radius at the moment is at 1.5 and that gives us a small amount of sharpness as you can see going on here. You can also see a little bit more noise going on. So you might want to reduce the noise in the image before you start to sharpen. But we've got a nice thing happening here. I really like this with a slight amount of sharpening. Now you might not be able to see this properly, so I'm actually gonna go hard and bring the sharpening all the way up to about six. And that gives us a much more kind of clarity type of effect. If we zoom out, notice how the parts of the image that are out of focus almost seem to be coming into focus with this level of Gaussian blur. I'm going to hit OK. We'll delete the top layer. Right click the image and choose new from visible. And then delete the other helping layer. So we've now got the high pass filter here. You can go ahead and remove the color from inside this layer. I'm not going to do that yet. I'm going to change the blend mode to grain merge and that brings back that sharpening effect. So if we now zoom in, you can see we've got a nice sharpening going on there. Let's zoom in a little bit more and you may be able to see that sort of intense color effect that's happening with the sharpening layer. Let's get rid of that coloring effect by going to colors, desaturate, desaturate and choosing lightness. That's before, that's after. It's a very subtle effect. And you can miss that if you want to. If you like the colors, you can miss that particular step. This is our sharpened image. If we want to control the amount of sharpness, we can actually go and choose the overlay blend mode. Soft light, hard light. You might want to choose linear light if you're going into print and you need some really intense sharpening. And you can also go to colors, brightness, contrast, and you can play around with the contrast to reduce the amount of sharpening, or if you want to, to actually increase the amount of sharpening a little bit. We'll hit OK. Let's do another before and after. And we can now flatten the image. So that's how you sharpen using the high pass sharpening filter inside of GIMP. 2.10.8. That was great fun. Let's do this again sometime. I'll see you later. Bye.